Hi, Bob C here. And uh, what we're looking at here is the Roland uh, TD1 pads. Um, you might recall them if you saw any of my videos with the poor man's uh, electronic dump, uh, dr drum set. And uh, the whole thing with this was I was thinking of chopping them down inside and then putting them together to make like a, a quad pad. Um, trying to condense electronic uh, drum kit and that would represent, if, you had, if I had four of them together, that would represent the uh, four toms. But uh, um, it turned out to be different than I thought, but I'll show you what's inside since I'm here right now anyway. So this is the pad, right? You got plastic here. You got uh, aluminum plate there, which um, I couldn't exactly see it on here. But I'm sure in the center, they got the uh, the transducer. And then they got a nice surface here. And between uh, this plain surface and the aluminum plate, they have this rubberized, eh, it's kind of a sponge rubber type of deal. Um, but I guess that's what they thought would give a good plain surface. And it, it does work out well. That's why I chose these because uh, um, you can get them quite reasonable, usually like around 20 bucks a piece or maybe a little more, a little less, uh, depending. And um, uh, I actually cut it with the hacksaw because I didn't know what was inside. And I was afraid, uh, even though I have table saw, radial saw, um, I was afraid with uh, with rubber, uh, a fast spinning blade can just grab it and you don't know what the heck, it, uh, it may just uh, throw it off or if your hand's on it, you may get your hand sucked into the blade or something like that. So uh, just to be safe, I did it with the hacksaw and I wouldn't recommend uh, because of the previous uh, reasons I mentioned, I wouldn't recommend using a high speed saw. Uh, it takes quite a time to do it with the hacksaw, but uh, at least you'll have your fingers left at the end of the day. So, I just wanted to show you what it looks like inside in case you're thinking of doing anything with these, uh, what you'll run into. Okay, catch you on the next one. Bye.